All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to download photographs from your SD card and put them into your computer. So you're going to go and grab your SD card and be careful which way you put it in. So you're going to put it into your card reader, card reader, whether it's on the side of your computer or if you have an SD card reader. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to uh, File Explorer, which is that manila folder here. And then we have some options here. We want to go over on the left-hand side here and find our ESO Digital. So in here, we'll have some photographs. Now, uh, I'm going to change the view around because you might be seeing it kind of like this. If you just see these the list and you want to actually see some images, you can go to where it says View. So if you don't, let's just go to where it was. Well, all right, we'll go to where it was home. So then you go to View, just so it looks differently. And then you can go to Large Icon. Now, right now, we're seeing what's on the SD card that we just put in. We want to put them in the Creative Cloud, so we're going to go ahead and open up another window like this. You can go Control and the letter N. So if you hold down on Control and push the letter N, one of these windows will pop up. And let's see how let me grab it. Okay, so now I can drag this over here. So you want to have two of the windows. On this one over here, this is where we're going to drag our images to. So we're going to go to our Creative Cloud. That's where we're going to be saving all of our stuff now. And uh, if you have a lot of pictures here and you only want to drag over a few, you can just drag one at a time like that. Um, you can hold control and select the images individually like that. Or if you know you want to bring everything in, you can hold, you can click the first one, hold shift, click all of them, and then just drag the images over. So we've dragged the images over and now they are in our creative cloud. And if you use the creative cloud, if you download the app on your phone, these images will now be on your phone. And if you have, uh, if you install Creative Cloud on your laptop or your home computer, those images will sync there as well. You'll be able to have access to them in multiple locations. So that is how you download your images, and now you're ready to start working on them in Photoshop or wherever we might be.